News of Disney acquiring Fox came out last year, and though Marvel fans were in on the idea, negotiations were stopped when Comcast decided to offer a lot more money to acquire Fox. While some would hate the idea of taking away X-Men and Fantastic Four from Marvel again, it's possible that the two companies could end with a compromise. Industry analyst Barton Crockett has suggested to CNBC that the two companies can actually split on the Fox assets and keep whichever they want for themselves. My sense is that Comcast is particularly interested in Sky, and Disney might have much more interest in much of the rest of it. It's said that Comcast's interest in Sky is so that they will be able to better grow itself overseas. Of course, losing Sky would be a blow to Disney when it comes to TV, but it still manages to give them the upper hand when it comes to Hollywood dominance. Not to mention, every other Fox movie will fall into the Disney archives. Probably the biggest takeaway for a comic book movie fan is that, though Disney won't own Fox entirely, there is still a chance that they could acquire X-Men and the Fantastic Four and bring them to the MCU. This also means something for Star Wars as well. Fox currently holds the original cut of the Star Wars trilogy, and if the acquisition pushes through, we could be looking at an HD release of the original movies, something that a lot of fans have been clamoring for. The vote for the acquisition is expected to happen on July 10th. Hopey it in ends with all parties being happy.